Hey guys, it's Stephanie and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. If you are new, please subscribe down below. I post twice a week and today I'm going to be doing a vlog of kind of behind the scenes of how I film a sit down video. Today I'm going to be filming a bake with us video with my friend Hope who's a really good baker. She's going to come over today and we are going to bake a strawberry shortcake ice cream bar inspired cake. So I thought that I would take you along kind of behind the scenes of that and just kind of show you what I'm doing today since I haven't vlogged at all this week. So yeah, let's just kind of jump into today. All right, so I've already just gotten dressed. I will show you guys my outfit in my full length mirror in a minute, but now I'm kind of sitting at my desk slash vanity and I'm just gonna put on some makeup. You guys have seen my vlogs or if you haven't, I don't really wear too much makeup on a day-to-day -day basis, especially now that I nanny every day, but for more like sit down, kind of videos. I like to do my makeup because it's an excuse to get ready and do my makeup and I actually really like doing so. So I thought that I would quickly kind of just like speed through this part for you guys so you can see what I do if you're curious at all. If you want to see a little more of a detailed get ready with me, I will link that one down below and up in the eye for you guys in case you are curious. So that is everything that I'm gonna do for my makeup right now. I do have my Rimmel Exaggerate Lip Liner in East End Snob and my Fenty um, Beauty Lip Gloss in Fussy that I'm going to put on right as we film the video so it's fresh and not like goopy and everything. Plus, I still need to eat breakfast. So I will eat breakfast, get this on, and then I will show you guys kind of my final outfit before we film. All right, so I finished getting ready. I threw some earrings in, and I'm just wearing this cropped t-shirt from American Eagle, and then these high-waisted shorts from American Eagle as well. And we are getting all set up to film. I have the camera set up, and Hope is over here measuring. <laughs> all of our stuff out so we can be extra prepared.
but hope this is your your vlog debut. Hello YouTube! <laughs> I'm excited! We also have a little friend here yes. with us who's a little camera shy apparently. He's a little camera shy, but he's so darn cute. He's got star quality. <laughs> Yeah, Hope is dog sitting for someone this weekend. So she brought our little friend over here to come bake with us. All right, so a little behind the scenes, we have two of our cakes or two layers of our cakes out of the oven. The third one is baking. So we're like halfway done with this bake with me video. And then we're going to do a Instagram live for Hope's Instagram channel. We're gonna do cookies. So I will make sure, or I will try to get some clips of that as well because I'm gonna be her little like co-host, yeah, sous, sous, sous chef, chef for it. But I will try to get some clips on my phone from it to put in this vlog. This is the aftermath of both cooking the cake and the Instagram live that I just did with Hope, although Hope really was in front of the camera for 90% of it. I helped respond to comments, basically. But She's essential. She we are, best. Hope is just finishing up icing the last couple cookies so we can take a fun picture for her Instagram. I will leave the link to, um, this recipe that she's doing on her blog down below as well as her blog and her Instagram. And then if the video of us making the cake is already up, that will be in the description box as well. I haven't decided if this is gonna go up before or after the cake video yet. I'm thinking the cake video will go up first. So definitely check the description box for that. So it is 3.20 right now. I just got back from dropping Hope Hope, pack off at her apartment. I cannot talk today as per usual, but I got a package from Etsy today. And since I am trying to show you guys my Etsy orders as they come in, especially if I'm vlogging that day, I thought that I would show you guys this one. This is a custom tumbler, like a water bottle tumbler um, that I got from, oh my God. I forget the name off the top of my head, something Collins, Studio Collins. I will link it down below as per usual, but I actually did a trade with her, which was super cool. So I did two digital illustrations for her in exchange for this tumbler. So I'm so excited that it came today. There's a lot of glitter in this package, but it is very nicely wrapped. And so she does a lot of like Disney themed ones and she had a, um, a Cinderella one that was blue. So I asked her if she would be able to do a Rapunzel one for me because Rapunzel is my favorite Disney princess even though I am 23 years old. I have a favorite Disney princess and oh my God, you guys. I, I'm holding it up and you can't even see but she just did like the silhouette, like the outline of Rapunzel. And then it did come with a straw as well. I believe this is 16 ounces. So it's a little bit smaller than what I usually drink out of, but it's nice because now I have another like smaller kind of water bottle and this will be perfect for my liquid IV since it's 16 ounces. But yeah, it's just a like plastic metal, or not metal, it's a plastic tumbler. And I'm so excited to have a little Rapunzel one now. So in addition to the Etsy package, I got my final order of clothing in that I wanted to show you guys. So I kind of ordered a lot of clothes over the past like week or two um, because of like 4th of July sales and having a paycheck again, I was able to get some new stuff. Let's jump into it. I have a bunch of swimsuits that I'm gonna start off with. So first from Airy, I just have this little olive kind of like scoop neck with the, just like the normal like bra straps. And it's, a, it's like borderline too small, like it fits me, but I totally probably could have sized up. Um, for reference, if you guys are curious, I get my tops from American Eagle or Airy 
at, in smalls, but like I said, this one is a little small, so I kind of wish I got a medium. Um, for sizing reference, I wear a 32B, if that helps you kind of decide. So yeah, I got this top and then this olive bottoms that go with it. I think these are their cheeky, the cheeky ones. And I get an extra small in bottoms usually. And then also from American Eagle, I got this v-neck top and it's like really cool like different shades of blue and like neon green neon yellow like highlighter yellow and this fits perfectly and it's a small so that's why i can never really figure out my sizing on airy but this one's a small and fits and but the bottoms are these white ones which like white is kind of risky bottom wise i feel like but it has the same like neon pattern and this is an extra small believe it or not i feel like this is a really big extra small but it fits so it's more of like a high cut kind of bottom as well and then i actually ordered three swimsuits from zaffle but one of them literally my boobs did not fit into it at all so i gave that one to hope because it will likely fit her the two that i got that did fit are this kind of like triangle typical bikini top in this like pink and purple tie-dye i guess and it just has like more like sports bra bra type straps and then the bottom is just a very standard um like bikini tie string bikini bottom and then the other one that i got from zaffle that fits <laughs> is I have the bottoms in my bag for babysitting but it's just this um ribbed bandeau type top and then just very standard bikini bottoms that look just like this like i said i threw them in my bag for babysitting and then the last bathing suit i got from orel rl this is the name of the company they were running an instagram ad that was $28 for any of their bathing suits. Like all their bathing suits were $28 for both the top and the bottom. So I was like, you know what? Why not? Since apparently I'm in bathing suit mode now. So I got, what style is this? Maria. And I got a size small in both pieces because you have to buy the same size in the top and bottom, which I kind of hate, but this is just the top. It looks like, just looking at it, looks like it might be a little small, but I, this one I have not tried on yet and it's like a really really pretty cobalt blue and then just some these are a little more like high cut bikini bottoms but just very standard bikini bottoms and then one kind of really fun purchase was a pair of lululemon align leggings <sighs> i've resisted for so long because it just seems i can't even fathom spending $100 on a pair of leggings, just a pair of leggings. But everyone raves about them and says they're the best ever. And I wanted to kind of treat myself um, with one of my paychecks from my job and get myself something that I actually have been wanting for a long time and wanting to save up for. So I decided to use part of my paycheck on a pair of aligns. For sizing reference in these, I got a size two. I usually wear a size zero in pants and shorts, but everyone says to size up one size and these fit me really well. I got the standard 28 length, inch length, even though I'm only five feet tall. So eventually when things start to reopen again and I feel safe going in, I will go and get these hemmed a little bit so they're a little more appropriate length for me but also with it being the middle of summer, I am not at all in a rush to go get these hemmed, but I did want to include them in my clothing haul. Moving into uh, American Eagle, I actually got this shirt that I'm wearing today. I really like their, I think they're called their baby tees. I'm pretty sure these are the baby tees. They're just like the cropped ones like I showed you earlier. I have it in a really pretty mauve color as well. And they were on sale for like less than $15 each. So I got it in this really pretty like teal green color. And then I also got it in this really pretty like peach color. It's looking a little bit like bright on camera, but it's definitely not that bright <laughs> in person, but it's like a really pretty like coral peach color. And then I got two of these. 
because I have one in like a multicolor. I don't know exactly what these are called, but I will link everything that I can still find down below for you guys. Um, it's just these like little basic tank tops and it's in this like gray color. I have one just like this and it's in like a multicolor, like bright one and I really like it and it's cropped, of course. Um, and so I just wanted to get it in black and then I got it in cream as well, just so I could wear it with any color shorts um, and just have like some good like basic pieces. So this is the cream one. And for sizing reference, in American Eagle tops, I am always an extra small, almost always an extra small because I feel like their stuff runs really big. And then last but not least, I have a few pieces from Old Navy. I think one of the pieces isn't here yet. Hope actually influenced me to purchase from Old Navy this week because they were having 68% off. But I started with this pair of shorts. They're just navy blue and white striped, like jersey, like linen material shorts and they have a drawstring which is great i got an extra small in these as well i'm usually an extra small in bottom but i'm excited for these and then i also got a t-shirt dress because i really like t-shirt dresses even though they're usually pretty long on me but what size is this this is a small i totally should have gotten an extra small this looks really big um it's hard to tell but it's just a like blue t-shirt dress and I think I spent I got five items from Old Navy and only spent like 60 bucks so got a really good deal on everything there as well and then last but not least from Old Navy I got two of their workout like tie tank tops so I mean it's pretty see-through <laughs> but it has like a little hole in the back right here like a little people and then all the way at the bottom it just ties in a little knot so it's got a little bit of an open back which is not usually my favorite but to go to babysitting i don't care if my back is a little exposed exposed because i wear a sports bra anyway so i got it in this like dark gray slash black color and then i got it in this um light gray color as well just to have some more like i said basic pieces that can go with all my different colored shorts and everything. So that is everything for my little clothing haul. Also, I didn't even show you guys, but Hope finally gave me my birthday present because I literally have not seen her since March before like spring break and everything. But she got me a little Hydro Flask in the color that I was talking about getting. So I'm so excited now I have another water bottle and I can put some cool stickers on this. Oh, thank you again, Hope. You are literally the best. So right now I am just getting my clips organized between the vlog and the baking video. I think I finished editing the baking video already. It's like 5.30, so I've been working on it for a hot second but I really like to edit as I go and edit while the videos are kind of fresh in my mind, if that makes sense. So I remember things that I wanted to edit out when I was filming or whatever. But yeah, just kind of wanted to give you a little behind the scenes into the editing process as well. I'm gonna eat some dinner now and probably watch Hamilton on Disney Plus because it came out today. So I'm super excited, honestly, to get a break from looking at myself and filming myself today. So that'll be fun. In case anyone is curious as to what I'm eating for dinner, I just toasted a piece of rye bread, put a slice of cheddar cheese on there and then fried up an egg. I'm not super hungry because we ate kind of a late lunch. Yeah, so this is dinner for now. I might make something else or eat more of the pasta salad later though. Hey guys, so it is actually the next day. I totally forgot to end this vlog last night after I finished watching Hamilton. So I'm just popping in here to end it now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you liked it. And definitely leave me a comment below with what you wanna see next from me and I will see you in my next one.